So, a super quick tour of the nursery tables. It's July 15th. I'm about two weeks behind her, where I would typically be. Um, I got totally invalided by the long COVID for a couple of months, but emerged just in time to really catch the last part of the first major seeding window for the backbone of our outside winter crops, or field crops as we call them, and they're mostly in the Brassica oleraceae family. It's one of the reasons, I don't know if you can notice, that most of these little babies all look rather similar. That's because they're all in the same family. Brassica oleraceae accounts for uh, Brussels sprouts, broccolis, cabbages, cauliflowers, cold rabbits, kales and collards, European kales. Um, and they're all essentially the same plant, except plant breeders through the centuries have called forth different aspects of them. You know, the leaves for the kales and the collards and the stems for the kohlrabis and so on and so forth. Um, we've also got uh, Brassica napus, which is the Russo-Siberian kales and rutabagas that are here. And then we move into beets. I've already sown my beets in the ground, but it's a little early for most people even to be thinking about winter gardening. So I like to um, grow up beets. They can be easily transplanted. They do very well uh, from transplants for them. And then I move into some of the more slower growing um, uh, plants, which are taking a little longer to germinate, the parsleys and uh, uh, root celeries and so forth and then we're back into stuff that's been more recently seeded. Timing's really critical with um, sowing for winter, oh you need the right for winter hardy varieties of course, but once the sun gets past the summer solstice everything essentially is hurrying towards a, um, a decline in light and temperature levels. So um, every day we miss in terms of saying, say, of, in terms of sowing, is more than a day lost. I just finished really sowing for this window today here, mostly uh, under the nursery tables here, um, leafy greens. There are kales and collards there. The heading brassicas might be a little late to get them to size up into the fall at this point, but um, but the leafy greens will still do well. So. Um, there's a lot more here than I'll use, but um, I'm uh, readying them for distribution to uh, cohorts and colleagues and allies and local friends and so forth. These beets, I, I beg your pardon, these leeks, for example, I plant, finished planting mine yesterday. I'll get them out to friends at a birthday party um, just down the road next week. Okay, and then what do we have here? The holy object, Bluetooth and uh, the dog uh, having a really tough day in the shade.